I feel it. This will be funny. Here, let's get some of this. <laughs> Today is December 26, 1991. This is the day after Christmas, 1991. Mary, Linda, Carol, and Kathy, in an effort to leave you some history of our family, I've come up with the idea of taking the slides we made and putting them on tape. Because I have fond memories of our family together, I think you and your children may enjoy them too. I will na narrate them along with Mary, and Bill will take them off the screen. This is the first uh, picture we took with our slide camera in 1958. The three little girls and Tabby the cat in front of the zebra perhaps. And the neighbor's cat, the little girls dressed alike, and the dresses mother made. Mary, as a little bluebird in second grade, all excited about the bluebirds. The beautiful... Jack, Mary, and Linda at the back of our house. I think we're going to have to go faster. And this is at uh, 6065 Pier Street in Arvada, right? That's right. So we built our home. Uh, purchased at the PTA fair at Seacrest, their school. Those hats. Yeah, you should. Ooh, look at that wallpaper. <laughs> nice and bright. The little Kathy, baby Kathy, in the high chair. Our old church on Webster Street in Arvada, the stained glass window. And at Christmas time, Kathy substituted for the baby Jesus with her sisters lovingly looking on. Linda's the sheep. <laughs> Aren't they happy little girls? What Mary? Christmas is this? 1958. Daddy Jack, and he just had gotten that new robe for Christmas. Neighbor Grandma Gilbert, who babysat the girls quite often. And the Wilkerts at Christmas dinner. There we are at Homewood Park, skating away. The cousin Ted Smith kids. Uh, there, there's Ted and Doug and David, Carol and Kathy and Mary. Actually, no. I don't think uh, Doug is there. No, it's Mark. Yeah, yeah brother. <laughs> With her tongue turned over. Uh, <laughs> oh, there's all four, five, six, seven of them in the mirror. Sweet little baby Kathy in her pen. Oh, it was Linda's birthday, and uh, Jeanette Gattenby was here. Oh, some of the Harbert clan. Grandma, Harbert. The lady, see the lady on the right side? Yeah. That's my dad's mother. That's grandma, my grandma Harbert. Yes, Aunt Willa and John. Oh, it was Mary's birthday, and Carol's making a face. Oh, Easter bonnets, all dressed up for Easter. Mommy made most of their clothes. There she is in her blue outfit, little Cassie. What a beautiful baby. <laughs> the Swartzels, who had four daughters, spent Easter with us. Oh my, Carol had a birthday party, April 19th, and it was so rainy outside, they had to all be inside. The Hannahs and us went on a picnic, and Mary had broken both arms, was in a cast, could hardly feed herself. What a wimp. <laughs> Little neighbor, Jimmy Hamilton, they played with, outside with the ducks. 
Oh, and they're dumb. What, Bill? Hey, Daddy. Grandma Harvard and the girls ready for church. And Daddy. Oh, Aww. Carol's little friend, David. Jimmy, wasn't it? Well, David was old, so oh. this is Jimmy. Yeah, that's right. This is Jimmy Hamilton. Gotta get these guys straight. And there they are, uh, Paul Hamilton and Dad out and back, putting in the back 40 into grass. The girls wash the car. Aren't they good helpers? Out of the Elitches on the Ferris wheel. Brave Mary and the Kitty Ferris wheel. Yeah. And poor Kathy didn't like the clown. Cried her eyes out. Oh. Proud Sister Carol with baby Kathy in her stroller, Dolly stroller. Oh, you can see Mary with the white blouse and the skirt, and she hit her arms because they still were in cast at their operetta. And I had a lead role in that operetta, and I had to get out of it. That's right. That's why I never became an actress. So Daddy and his mustache. He grew that for the centennial. Oh, the ducks. We, we usually had some ducks for Mr. Coon and gave them back to him later in the fall. Was that our dog, Freddy? I think that was a neighbor's I dog. I think that was Hamilton's dog. Yeah. Ooh. What a swim. Be sure to watch out how far you go. What a fashion plate. <laughs> Look at those caps. <laughs> Oh, the turkeys are in the foreground. <laughs> Those are kids behind. A kid in a pail. Uh, Cabby with the carvers up at Steamboat Springs, and it rained a lot. And they shaved like their daddies, these little mm -hmm. shavers. That's Nancy and Donnie Carver. Right? Yeah. We went horseback riding, and what a beautiful ride. We saw beaver and deer and all kinds of animals. Oh, out to Grandma and uh, Uncle Bob's Flemings on the farm. Was in, in Iowa, right? Three kids in a tub. That's the way you take a bath on the farm. And a litter of pigs that uh, Daddy helped deliver, you might say. The old barn, put, putting the bale of hay into the hay loft. Uncle Bob with his tractor and a dumpster full of kids. Let me say something to me. There we are at a Fleming reunion in Darwin, Iowa. All these Fleming relatives, Uncle Frank and you know somewhere. And in Indiana, there's Donnie Snyder and Kathy Harbour. The Fleming sisters and their husbands. <laughs> what a gorgeous bunch. <laughs> <laughs> and the fathers feeding their new babies born the same year. Fleming sisters. There we are at the Snyder's, Simpsons. The whole gang. Kathy wasn't there yet. She wasn't? No, they're not. She? Yeah, she's there. She's oh, right there on, on the your lap? Okay, okay. See her. I couldn't see her. Sure she is if Dottie's there. And that's out in back of Cindy's place and Bob's. Across the street, taken from Grandma Gilbert's, our house that we built and moved into in 1952. It's next door, Sexy Mary. <laughs> At Bonita, Grandma Harbor, Willis Sue visited us. Today we got peanut butter in the background. Today we got back to Indiana. 
And there's Carol with her little friend across the street. I don't remember her name. Celia? Celia. Oh, here's the powwow kids. I think they did this at school, didn't they? They have a powwow at school. In our backyard. Pretty flowers. Beautiful Colorado. Oh, Kathy's acting up. There's a jab kit. <laughs> Hasn't changed a bit. Oh, out at the zoo, the Denver Zoo. See the big white bear back there? Halloween. Crying Kathy, scared to death. Daddy reading the Christmas story before we open a gift the night before Christmas. <coughs> yeah, those are the same stockings we got. Sure. We're only in short room. Oh, in Mary's room. Kathy with a doll. Oh, look at the three dressed alike. That was Kathy's cradle she got from Grandma Fleming. That must have been her second year. This must yeah, be 1959. Yeah. Ted Smith were with us on Christmas. with the Pete Snyder's visiting us. Out of the kitchen, happy little Kathy. We are adding on to our place. Oh, I took that picture. See, there's our bare wall, Jim, and our addition that we added on. And uh, it is Linda's birthday. Toothless. <laughs> Oh, this is up at our new church site. We built snowmen before we built this in 1962. We were ahead of our time. We were women's livers. Oh, Grandma was here. Look at the candles on her cake. It's a great picture. Got, it's like it's a starting a fire there. <laughs> oh, it must be Mary's birthday. Yeah, yeah, there's Mary's friends. Kathy on the potty where the freezer someday would be. We've been to church on Sunday, probably Easter. Oh, Mom's birthday when Dad was April 25th. Oh, Mary, you're receiving your Flying up. Flying up. <laughs> Going down to Colorado Springs to the zoo that Sunday morning. With the Carvers. And there we ate Oklahoma where Jack Harvard was born and raised in Little Sioux. What's the address? 216 South Mississippi Avenue, Ada, Oklahoma. This is uh, Okay, where is this? Um, Tombstone? No, um... Where did, uh... Gunsmoke. Gunsmoke. In What's Nebraska. the name of that town? What's the name of their town? <laughs> can't think of it. There's the... the Boot Hill. Boot Hill. <laughs> Visiting the Davises, the Dick and uh, Hope Davises down in Oklahoma. There's Grandma and Grandpa Harvard's house. Carol. Over at Aunt, Aunt Novus. Yeah, I think that's right. Aunt Novus in Ada, Oklahoma. We took Aunt May and Aunt Nan up to Bertha Pass and took them on a trip to the mountains. There they are in our backyard. No time to visit us. That is your cousin. Ted Smith's brother, who is Phil, he's a psychologist in his family, this is this one. There are the, the Pete Snyder kids and the Jewel Harbors. That picture's in backwards. Out in front, the same 
lunch, Joy and Jeff, and Carol. They, oh, Dottie had the measles, and then Kathy got them after they left. Oh, <laughs> oh, what two couples went to e legends and had lobster and danced to big jerks and mom took the pot on the guy's coat dance. But there we are, ready to add on our patio and keep going to shopping. There's Kathy with the pieces of the kitty. Strangling the cat. in the front, huh? Yes. God, look at those bathing suits of that lady. <laughs> there we camped, and that night a skunk was outside of our tent. Spared us. That's uh, Twin Lakes, near Independence Pass. We met this guy with his wagon, covered wagon.
That's in Green Mountain, right? Yes, Green Mountain. Where is it? So I don't know Bob's showing four. Uh, Uncle Fred's feeding his pigs. Oh, Kathy and the boxer dog. Stormy. Stormy. We had to pick the can't see him too well at Marshalltown, Iowa. There's my cousin Jean Fleming. Oh, and she had they had little deers, fawns. Mary's room, right? Yep. Boy, is that attractive. Yeah, she designed all that. No, I think it was Dad's office in there, and he put that in his office before it was my bedroom. Oh, okay. Right? That might be. Yeah, I guess that was. Out and back with Grandma Fleming visiting in Dad's office that he built. So he must have had his office in the house before, didn't he? Yes, he did. For a little while? For a little while in that extra room. Yeah. That we built. Well, this is up at near El Dorado, uh, picnic. Anita and Sue, Grandma Fleming. These are new addition. Yeah. There's a three generations there. Grandma Fleming, one down. Eating on oh somebody's birthday party. It's up there in the picnic. This is a time we went up to Idaho Springs. And it snowed. And we got snowed in, 20 inches of snow, and we had to stay in this cabin. Our tent was under all that snow. On a good tent. Yeah. Well, that was our came home, and it looked like this, because this was 1st of September. Right? Campfire camp. Was this Camp Long? Yeah, I think so. Well, oh, that was great. Oh. The campfire girls from Newburgh to regular campfires. What a rear end. <laughs> Look at those permits. Yeah. Oh, are they dressed up? Looks like they've got a campfire out. Willa Sue and Grandma Harvard, I recognize. Hey, that's Aunt Mary Kate, isn't it? Yes, it is. And Aunt, Aunt Elmer? Mary Kate. And Aunt Elmer. No, that was her friend, Aunt Mary Kate's friend. Oh, okay. Up at Loveland, all of us went up. Look at those cars. Yeah. <laughs> what is that, a Chrysler station wagon? This is in 1961. And uh, we. Day. We went up. No one skied, but we had a great time staying at the Baker cabin further down. More campfire stuff. Like this I is said. in the basement of Davis's house. Christmas again. And we had Grandma and Willa Sue with us. All playing house. Gating up at Lake, Lake Pactolis. Are we dancing? <laughs> Who knows? More campfire girls. Oh, Mr. Delaney next door. Grandpa Gilbert and Grandma Gilbert and Lovin' Birds. What a grill. Oh, Here's Cheryl Dash. Yes. Lenore. Dad's standing on his head. I didn't know he could even do that. <laughs> oh, there's the Campfire Girls again. Must have been wow, somebody's anniversary or something. Oh, out in 
back. Carol got a new bike. Look at that on her birthday. <laughs> what a bike.
they wouldn't let us climb on them. At Mom Cook's house, right next to the house we rent. Kathy got to go there. Oh, out in 
back. You don't have those dumb hats. Zelly do. Birthday party. Oh, this is up at the. Uh, where is this, Mary? I don't know. Somewhere in the mountain. Yeah. Grandma Fleming. Up on uh, Mount Evans, where we scored it. It's 14,000 feet high. The carvers again, camping with the carvers. Campfire girl nice group. Glasses. Halloween. You know who's who? <laughs> that tall witch is my mom. Oh, Thanks a lot. <laughs> <laughs> These are people that work for Jack. It's bad. They're from Poland. That's our church going up. Huh. Believe. Mm -hmm. Looks like it. Yeah, that's where it is. At uh, 68th and car. And Dad did the structural and design, didn't he? Dad did. And the building is holding up well to this day. <laughs> nice class, Mom. Thanks. Yeah, there we are. Another Christmas. Must be 62, isn't it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it would be. Mary's reading the Bible, the Christmas story. Oh, I mean, it. <laughs> Look at that bloody Carol guy. <laughs> oh my oh. gosh, my square dance panel loom. <laughs> made him that gown, those, that shirt. Like it with a belt, especially. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Got my first transistor radio right there. Dad, Dad made that. That was a big deal. Yeah. He in the backyard in the snow, playing fox and geese or whatever. Playing football. Oh, that's the Gables. Or the neighbors down there. They spent Christmas. Up at Lake Pactolus. Who's up there? The heavy bird? Swanee. Mm -hmm. so oh. Who's that? These are people from uh, Hungary that the Carmers helped bring over here. Like tetherball. Tetherball. They're also playing badminton. Yeah. Yeah. Front dance office. Pactolis again with a Smith and Will Sue. Mm -hmm. And Bull. Oh, look at the cow. Them boots are made for walking. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Linda. The dog. <laughs> All oh, these girls spent uh, the night with us. I forget Germany and somewhere in Europe. They look Japanese. They look Japanese. I love glasses. That's okay, Dad's birthday. Well, this is the gondola that Jack Harbor designed for Upper Custer, South Dakota. There it shows how to go up the mountain to a restaurant above. Another birthday for Mom, Harvard. And here we are, square dancing again, the same clothes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, here's Cinder with Carol and Kat in their pretty dresses. I'm not sure who that is. Carol out in the back. Iris is a blue Campfire camp up at uh, to Big Tops of Canyon with the girls. We made a bean pot and buried it in the coals. Here we are in Indiana at the Snyders. Helen and Pete Snyders. We're getting ready to go square dancing again. That's right. We square danced and wore my shoes out on the tennis on and this is at Cindy's and Bob's, hmm. the three sisters. And here are the cousins together, the Jackie and Beth Susan, the little Harbor girls. 
Dad yeah. would have to stop and look under bridges. This is out of their friends, or the big fish fry, the Snyder's friends. Look at that convertible. Yeah. Well, there's little Nancy came in the picture. Nancy Snyder, Donnie's little sister. The Teat Snyder's. All four children now, four. All dress up girls at Aunt Sin's. I like that uh, Japanese girl there. She got, I like that short moo moo that you got. Oh, over the bridge. Yeah, there we are, camping on Lake Michigan. In the sand dunes, was it? In the sand dunes. Yeah. And their tents, the Snyders and the Harvards. Kathy and Donnie. Back to the Snyders in the Lapel, Indiana. George and Wilma Nickel live in Vanport, Iowa, my, my cousin. There we are in Indi oh no, we're in Marshalltown, Iowa with Uncle Earl and Billy, my cousin Jim in the front there. Mother. Uncle Bob. Aunt Ben and Matt, Nellie and Mother, the three sisters left. The Nichols sisters. Uncle Earl, Matt, Nellie, and Tim. You know Uncle Pete or Uncle uh, Fuzz? Uncle yeah. Fuzz. No <laughs> hair, so we called him Uncle Fuzz. I named him. Uncle, that's not Uncle Bob, that's his neighbor. Yeah. It looks like Uncle Bob. Uncle? Why would you take a picture of his neighbor? That's true. <laughs> there he is. There he is with a load of uh, oats. A load of foxes in the back. Yeah. <laughs> the tall court of Iowa. We thought Linda got lost in that cornfield one time. She's hiding in the attic. This is Scoop and Ina Nickel up at Green, Iowa. And they There's a bunch a lot of, of turkeys right there. Right there. We took us out to this turkey farm. The Bill's Bible. And Nellie and Uncle Earl at their place in Darwin, Iowa, where I was raised. At their pub in the back of their house. There's pedal pushers that Kathy's got on. Yeah, there's Well, yeah, you'd think that Jack Harbour was operating that, but I don't think he did now. There's an out in the pig pen. Uncle Bob's farm. There he's got that loader again. There's Stormy and little Kathy. We always stopped at motels between Iowa and Colorado so the girls could go swimming. Don't laugh, Hill. <laughs> Car were camping again. <laughs> Looks like it rained every time you went. It rained did. Or snow it did. It seemed like every time we go past. <laughs> oh, Grandma was here. We took a ride in the mountains. Had a picnic. I mean, everybody toes in line. Oh, that's unusual. <laughs> oh, well. we went horseback riding quite often when we go up and go camping. Tackling the other horse. Back with Jack Harvey. Dad on his horse. <laughs> Mama, no. <laughs> Oh, this is camping up Chicago Creekway, and there, you girls were getting campfire points by cooking certain meals. I bet they, you that was interesting. Kathy starting kindergarten. Oh, we had to take, sand that whole house because we put a varnish finish on it. Oh, that looks like fun. Oh, that looks good. Boy, who is that person on the left? There's a tough looking old person. Who <laughs> I is still that? got that same paint outfit up there. 
this is up at Ted Smith's before their house mm, was built. Yeah, yeah. I remember, I know. That was still there. Yeah. And here's their new house they had built. Harold Carter, architect, Jack Carter, structural engineer, and all that. Mm. And our big station wagon. Huh. Oh, we went to the Ant Circus. That's what it was. <laughs> That's it. Okay, the fire group. Linda's the one that's a man, but on the other side she has a face and dressed like a woman. See the Jack Kennedy one or the No, the one with the red tie. Well that's Jack Kennedy. It looks like a face. Well I, it's a man's face. And the other side's a woman. Oh there they are in the red tie. This is down in Denver. I think it was uh, Veterans Day Parade. Backyard. In the winter time, one of the Mom with her coat that she got because the front of her cupboards burned and she collected eighty dollars insurance went down bar and the coat to fix the fix the cupboard doors herself. Again. This 1964? I think so. Went outside to show off our clothes. Made that dress in windows. Big snowflake in the window. Up at back toes again, where we went many a time. That used to be an old ice house. They keep ice out, ice in and put it on the train track to haul to other places. New belongs. This is my Navy friend, Joanne Crippling, and her two uh, children from California. Grab a water with Willa Sue with her hair on top of her head. <laughs> Behind her, dude. Another riding. <laughs> Oh, Dad loved his new chair he got for Father's Day. Isn't that nice? <laughs> this is uh, Paul Steiner. And uh, he was out here visiting. You can see he's a brother of Pete and Bob. Cats <laughs> and Let's stay on this one for a while. Move <laughs> in on that, Mary. Well, aren't the flowers pretty? All of us need some gymnastics and play tetherball. Always the best in. Okay, the here's a neighborhood party that we get. Loving birds and this little lady. Whose birthday was it? No, this is a bunch of kids that I kept because the teachers went. Mary, you went to church camp. See her there with the yellow hat on? And this was clear down. And Only one with a hat on there. <laughs> there you go, there's a trendsetter That's for That's our, our youth minister, Brad. We picked her up and we went on our way towards Mesa Verde. Isn't that beautiful country? That's at that's a, um, Wolf Creek Pass. Is it? That's Wolf Creek Pass. We're camping at Mesa Verde now. We stayed there four nights. Camping at Mesa Verde. Brushing our teeth. Who's up in the tree? <laughs> they had a church service. Looking out over the mountain. Here's some of the ruins. Mesa Verde. Mesa Verde National Park. That's a neat place. It sure is. Well, I'd like to go back there. Yeah. Down in the Keys? Keys? Kiva. Kivas? Kiva. Yeah. It's a round room. Oh, there's Linda. Oh. <laughs> These are some pictures. Oh, there's Mary. <laughs> the one that's 
what it probably looked like at that time. Riding the Durango to Silverton train. Narrow gauge. Narrow gauge. This is the area where they shot uh, a famous scene in Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid, where oh, he, uh, right? the Butch, Butch and uh, the Sundance jumped off of a cliff into a river after saying, who are those guys? <laughs> All the layers of sandstone. Oh, this is outside of Durango. The deer this we is saw. the Four Quarters area. Some more ruins. Mesa Verde. Oh, here's the Red Stone Mountain. Red, Red Mountain, Mountain Pass. Pass. Red Mountain Pass. Going up toward, oh, there's a big cavern at Uray. Box Canyon? Yeah. I think is what they call it. Looking down from our campsite on Ray. We, sat, we stayed here a couple nights because Jack and Linda were sick. Here we are above uh, Ray, Colorado, in Switzerland of America, camping above and looking down in the Uncomprehendra Forest. Un compadre. Okay, but. This is the year of 1964. We're in, over in a Ray area. In the, what's that, Black Fort? Black it looks Canyon. like the Black Canyon yeah, of the Gunnison, is the which Canyon is over near. Right yeah, that's what it is. Look how steep that is. Railroad track at the bottom. We are back in Harvard's dining area. There's a little Nancy Steiner. This is up in the Big Thompson Canyon, camping in a cabin for a few nights in the Big Tigers. There they are fishing. We went up and got on a glacier in the Rocky Mountain National Park. Tiger kids. All of us out in front. Kathy's friends for her birthday in August, 1964. Having a party. Mommy made the rocking. Camping in Iowa at the lake. And riding, Har Kathy riding Harvey Loney's pony. Is this in Iowa? This is in Iowa. Oh, this is when Uncle Bob and Aunt Lois got married, and all these guys, they, what did they do? They <laughs> Jerry rigged the whole house. Yeah, they really tore it up and painted signs all over. <laughs> See him, he's having a big time for him when he came home. The three Nickel sisters. The poor Harbert sisters. With fish they caught. Uh -huh. the Boy, those are real big ones. Those I are think. whoppers, man. You would never go hungry eating those. <laughs> oh, I'm Uncle Bob shelling corn. <laughs> oh, there's Kathy with the kitty and Uncle Fuzz. Strangling a cat again. Uncle Bob came home from his honeymoon and he, oh. he inherited four. The five daughters, Lois and daughters, that's a here. That's Mary. Well, this is coming back in Nebraska. 
Colorado. What's, what, what's the name of that area that's got all this museum? Pioneer Village. Was <laughs> yeah. We had a flat tire. They had to take everything out of the back end of the car. You see the projector the screen laying there? Yeah. Notice who's doing all the work. Yeah, yeah. poor dad. Oh, Mary and Debbie Leimer as, <laughs> as uh, Candy Stripers. Rehabilitation Center. Is it? Uh huh. Junior volunteers. Yeah. It's the beginning of my nursing career. The backyard with a beautiful flower. Up and uh, look out out. Red Rocks. Yes. Grandma comes back. Oh, the big uh, Labor Day Harvest, Harvest Festival in Arvada. That's where that's from. Here's Mary's in this junior high. I'm Mark. the one in the white blouse and the red skirt. The real yeah. good looking one. Yeah. Oh, where's this? That's a mine. Mine near Idaho Springs. This is Spring. the time that we uh, took our compass and used it to to uh, go across the mountains to another point with their compass. Mm -hmm. Half our group down in Arvada, the tree. Linda's group. Some more campfire girls. Oh, no, that's Limer. Yep, Debbie Limer, yeah. Wendy and Rory Warden. Mary's mm -hmm. behind them in the red. Campfire Chapel. Huh? Cock, <laughs> cock fighting contest. Well, mom and dad harbor. Another Halloween party, it looks like. Oh, this is a square dance group Halloween. <laughs> uh, who's who? Oh, there's Linda with her tie again. Carol Real original. Wasn't Carol the. Rover? Um, Is that the Rover? Yeah. First and time. Then Mary, you must have been the witch. You the well, this is felt. This is Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Jack had a trip there, and now it's a beautiful city. Kathy's. Oh, that's a good picture. And Bo and the three girls. Oh, Dad put together a organ. Still playing. Oh, yes. Oh, I traded that for the word is. Looks like a ding dong there in the red. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Christmas 1964 with Grandma Harbor, Aunt Willa, and Aunt Bonita, and Aunt Willa Sue. Well, everybody got a lot of presents, and Linda, I think, is putting a radio together with the help of her dad in a heath kit. Sliding up at Evergreen, we had toboggans and slides with the Smiths. Dancing Whoa. in the playroom. Oh, it must have been dad's birthday again. It was always the day before Valentine's Day. Boy, there's some good-looking girls. They always were. Well, out and back, Mr. Delaney's place in south of us. Then. Must have been, what was that, Linda's birthday. What right, is that? Right after Dad's, February 19th. Oh, I think that was a turtle. Turtle birthday cake. <laughs> oh. Do I recognize all those clothes I made? Fenders on that uh, older yeah, woman. Yeah, you there. like those, Hill? <laughs> <laughs> Go the buffalo to the left, going down the highway towards uh, U.S. 40. U.S. 40. And there we are camping at this cabin at Baker's. My kind of camping in a cabin. In a cabin. You guys finally gave up. You always got rain and snowed on, so you decided to just go to a cabin right from the start. Well, the people that were with us wouldn't have been able to take a tent. 
their first time on skis. Mary Harvard and Debbie Lyra. Well, that <laughs> down. There we are in our cabin up at uh, Winter Park ski area. Playing, Playing games. games as usual. And any time that uh, Mary and Debbie were off the skis, Carol and Linda were on. And the rest of us took a hike up to the side of the road, looking down on Winter Park ski area. Like it was windy. It does look that way. Oh, well, that's nice. There's Jack Harbert looking down on the ski area. A lot of snow. You can see how high the snow is by the height of the car. Bertha Pass. There's a Corvette. Oh, the campfire girls went out to eat and then they went to see the show Camelot? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, well, there I am. I tell you, those campfire girls are growing up. Oh, Ooh. happy, what does it say? Anniversary for 19th time. 19th, and the girls wrote us a great big poem about our life. Picture this. The Bunny Easter Centerpiece and our Clorox bottles. Well, something was funny. This is 1965. Looks like it might be like Mom, your birthday. Mom Harvard's birthday. April 25th. Oh, look at the little gymnasts out there with their little oh, those tiny, tiny bins there. He's <laughs> up there, all hanging there. hams. Look how small those trees are. <laughs> now hanging the other way. Aren't they a group? They were Looks like they had a reinforced pipe on that uh, swing set. <laughs> that <was> breaking. <laughs> Oh, let's get a splits, Barry. Couldn't do that anymore. <laughs> boy, oh boy, there is a loose woman. <laughs> this was a... Uh, what is this? This is when you displayed your dresses, wasn't it? I made her. No, it was a style show. There's Mary in the style show. Up at the Arvada Junior High. Oh, it was uh, Donnie, Don Sanders, David Sanders and Kathy were such good friends, except he fell out of a tree one time, broke his arm. Carmen Gable and the... Oh, this is a campfire meeting at the Wardens. Look at their beautiful uh, gowns and all their beads on their leather neck piece. They did a lot of work for that. Walking on the telephone. Looks like an insurance salesman to me. <laughs> Not yet. Getting teachers for Sunday school. That's the same town. I thought we'd seen pictures. that in the book. Well, that's Upside good and bad. Sitting by the sofa. Oh, Mary, no, Linda and Carol got their room decorated when they went to Grandma, or, Grandma Fleming's and Uncle Bob's for one summer, and we painted it. Dad made desks for both of them in that room. Everything was pink and white when they got home after five weeks in it Iowa. certainly is a very sexist uh, statement that you made there. Okay. Pink and white. Oh. And there's Mary in her bedroom and see her collage on the side. Now you did that, Mary. Yeah. What? There is a fox. <laughs> Right there, you mean? <laughs> and then because Dad had gotten a new uh, lounge chair, Mom got one too. <laughs> they were so comfortable. <laughs> In the backyard with the Russian olives, getting bigger trees too. Playing tetherball, it looks like Kathy and David. That looks like Barbara Burton. Mm -hmm. There's a time we went up in Memorial Day. There's Harold Burton. 
and Jack harbored, and uh, we couldn't go any farther because of the snow, and we had a picnic right there. Grilled our meal right there. Back in Iowa, and that men and that maze. Boy, it must be a nickel reunion. Who was that with Kathy? I don't know. Well, Uncle Bob, side yard, playing ball on the farm in Iowa. Oh, and over at the lake, making castles in the sand in Iowa. Oh, oh, who was that? <laughs> Oh, that's little Rodney. Rodney Fleming. Uncle mm -hmm. Bob changing Rodney, Rodney's diapers. There's a real farmer's tan for you. Really? <laughs> yeah. Oh, isn't he cute? Mm. Who's Lois? That is that Lois? Oh, I guess it is. And Cindy and Mom? Yeah. That's right. That's and here's the older generation sitting in the top back. Aunt Nellie and Uncle Earl's garden. Well, that was a nice Potatoes, one. tomatoes, and everything. There's Lois and Bob and little Rodney. There's a Bob Snyder family at Aunt Men's and May's. That's it. Okay. That's uh, Kathy, Nancy, Carol. Linda, Jackie, Mary, uh, Sandy, and Susan in the front of my girls' place. This is uh, at a motel we stayed where we went swimming on the way, on between uh, Nebraska and Colorado. We always stopped to go swimming, that was a big thing. Got a motel with a swimming pool. There's Mary, and there was oh, a flood. We, we got back to Colorado, and there was the worst flood Colorado's ever had on the Platte River. This is the year of '64. Yeah. This is, shows how the railroad was washed out. Look at this bridge. Jeez. It was a mess down there in that Platte River. Cars washed away, houses washed away. <laughs> it's getting the hair dried, Linda, or is that you? I don't know. I believe it's, it's Linda. Linda. Uh, practicing at 6 o'clock in the morning, then Mary would get in and practice at 6.30. Get their piano lesson. Who are these little girls? I don't know. Who's that? <laughs> Oh, More yeah. horses. Again. With the wheelers, it looks like. I think this is up at Estes Park. Yes, it is. At Estes Park, and we went fishing there. We would camp at the Mount Olivet Campground. Isn't that nice of that? Mm-hmm. It's a good one. Eating, and we we had our uh, tent, and a lot of the others had their regular there's a wheeler. There's a Stanley Hotel. Yeah, there it is. We stay at the Mount Olivet Campground. Then we go square dancing in the evening. That is the most beautiful picture of Columbine I ever got. Riding on horseback. <laughs> Old Linda's fixing the mail. I wonder if it's any good. Looks a little worried. This looks like it's up at uh, Central City, Cent or I know Central City. Purple Creek. No, I don't. Oh, this is. Uh, what is this? <laughs> it's a rainbow. I think maybe it is on that trip to Colorado Springs with uh, somebody. W. R. Snyder's. Another rainbow. Who's that? That's Jack sitting up on a rock with a bandana on his head. This is camping with the wheelers. This is above Central City camping. We'd go down to Central City and go square dancing up 
and cut up in the upstairs of the stabler. Oh, they decorate their bikes for the Harvest Festival Parade. Dangerous. Patty's for gold. <laughs> Patty's birthday with her friends. There she is with her friends. Scoop and Ida. Pan for gold there on the way to Central City. Uh, wait a minute. Yeah, and that's uh, Ted Smith's dad. There. And that's Nova. Nova. Nerd's game. Up at the Ted Smith's. This is probably Thanksgiving. All the Smith boys and the Harbor girls. Add Ball <laughs> headed for Alaska. All by herself. What a woman. Yes. There's Carol. Stand beside her. She got to Fairbanks and taught school up there for about 12 years. <laughs> what a bunch of gymnasts. Look at those curlers. <laughs> curlers with a big... <laughs> oh, they dress the kiddies up. <laughs> Ready for school. It must have been the first day of school. Oh, Linda looks happy. <laughs> Climax Molybdenum. Climax Molybdenum Mines to carry miners into the mine. What a picture of him. Grab a flubby good That's funny. Old miner there. Yeah. What that says. Who's that? I don't know. It's Dad. Okay, this is, yeah, it was with the Burtons. That was a one of the tower outlooks. And I don't know where that one was. But the birds were up there. Mm -hmm. Play it in the backyard. That was a great yard. Yeah, it was a big one, 260 feet deep. This is who? these extra people? I don't know. Is that the sources? Yeah. Well, who's the leaders there? Beats me. <laughs> oh, are they? We kidding? don't even know who these people are. <laughs> the Ted Smiths, it must have been Thanksgiving. Then they'd have a big football game out in the backyard. The Smith boys. Where was this? In our MR eating dining area. Mm -hmm. you know how? There they are playing football. Four Harvard girls and the three Smith boys and their dads. You know, they're making a pyramid. <laughs> you always had a good time. Then, didn't you? Well, Kathy. <laughs> <laughs> and Linda, finally. Portrait. Yeah. Back Ooh. in the back with his shirt down. <laughs> oh, Kathy. With a kitty. 
We always had kitties. He's always strangling cats. Every spring and fall we'd have kitties and we'd give them away. So we could have another batch. Oh, oh I got somebody got a rug. Look at all the things. Is there. that the same rug we've got in our bathroom now? <laughs> That's the same rug we have, Hill. <laughs> in our bathroom now. Yeah. <laughs> Grandma Harbor gave it to me. Is that right? Oh, I remember that. Oh, look at the dike gown. Let's see. What else is there? Is that uh, Irma, Irma Burton? Maybe mm -hmm. when Christmas with us was over there. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the neighbor's horse was loose, wasn't it? And it came into our. It doesn't look yeah. very loose to me. <laughs> like it's under control. Yeah, but it was a neighbor's horse. Well, I guess we had it to ride that day. Holy cow. <laughs> what was it like? How on? <laughs> Would you guys went to some... Uh, like an old-fashioned dress? Old-fashioned thing or... Yeah, something. something. Hopefully something. Well, there's a... Uh, did you get that Yep, sweater? still got that sweater, too. Yeah. Don't I'm not even going to make a comment about that. <laughs> There are the campfire girls. Look at all their pins and beads. Oh, Kathy looks real happy. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like she's about ready to fight somebody else here. Here's Linda with the mumps in 1965. <laughs> and here she is the next day. <laughs> here she is again. I'm learning to ski and it's so hard to get up. Mary's helping her. Look at those lace boots. Yeah. Didn't that have bow with who's knit that sweater? Yeah. Well, there's that Baker Lodge again. We stayed there two different times. Coming down the hill. Loveland. They have these husky dogs there. That's Loveland's gear. Oh, oh, my oh. goodness, it splits again. Jeez. <laughs> Mary, how'd you do that? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, my, Kathy's got a new tribe. There's a Swartz's on the dining area. I've There's seen that bunny centerpiece before. Yes, and I've lost that. And I'm sorry I lost it. <laughs> Three glass groups. Three happy looking. There's our Volkswagen, the only new car we ever had. Oh, this is a Horizon Club girl step going down to Colorado Springs Air Force Academy. There's the academy. Chapel. And they're marching. The sidewalk down to Dad's office where he and Bob Connor come up and eat. Whoop! We got a, <laughs> we got a hole on this one for a minute here. Isn't that a doozy? There's a cowgirl and a half there. Got in her dad's boots, her dad's hat. What's she holding? Who oh, no. She's holding a <laughs> pistol. Oh my Lord. A pistol with in there. Oh. Four bathing beauties. Jeez. <laughs> Kathy's about to dive in, I don't know where. <laughs> Those caps are horrible. <laughs> I always had to wear caps in those days. I know it. <laughs> Looking out over the mountains. Still had that car. Well, there's a little chip, Mom. Oh, where is this? That's oh, some this campfire. Is campfire camp. The new campfire camp. Guajillo, I believe it's called. Card on the... No, what is it? What was that card? Here? We're dancing again, as usual, once a week at least. The gang up at Mount Al, all the camp ground. Yeah, it is up there. Up in the big Thompson Canyon where we go to Grover's Inn to square dance. Janet Burton and Linda Harbert. Well, that's a good picture. Yeah. Sitting around, shooting the breeze. This is up at Estes Park. So, uh, Edie Mortimer got a fish hook in her shirt. From Kathy? I'm not sure. 
beautiful area up there. Isn't that a pretty place? There's Mark Mortimer, see there, camper. We had the tent and the rest of them had these campers. There we are sitting to our meal. Harbert family. Usually had ducks for the summer. We got them for the winter. Ducks and cats and dog, cinder. Trees are getting a little bigger there. Oh, uh, we could. Sure. Yeah, Carol groomed uh, Mitzi and got a pri second prize for her grooming up at the Harvest Festival. For her grooming or the cats? For her grooming of the cats. Oh. Four daughters. It's like Mary must have had contacts about them. Yes, yeah, she was the first one. Can yeah. you tell I'm squinting? There's our new church. Arvada United Methodist Church that Dad did the structure engineering on. Looking at our place from Grandma Gilbert's. Clematis's. Ducks again. <laughs> well, I tell you, the way you guys wear those swimming caps, you'd think you were swimming in the ocean or something <laughs> around there. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? <laughs> Interstate 70. Is it? Yep, I bet it is. Probably is. Oh, this is going down to Texas. <clears throat> oh, it's uh, Aunt, is that Aunt Alma. Alma? and Grandma Harvard and Aunt Alma's son, Jack, I believe is his name. There's Aunt Alma's in uh, Aunt Mary Kate's place mm -hmm. in uh, Alma, Texas, south of Dallas. Dallas. It wasn't Alma, Kemp. Kemp, Texas. Oh, wasn't that's it? right. Aunt Alma. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's an old ship or something out there. The Mississippi River? No, Texas. The Rio Grande? Who knows? <laughs> Some guy over that is. <laughs> Robert E. Lee. Eyes and I are home in uh, in Kansas. Maybelline? I mean Abilene. <laughs> Maybelline. <laughs> there there is his museum. Uh, Eisenhower Museum. That's it again. Well, this is uh, Truman's home in um, Purdue, Independence, Missouri. Missouri. Going down the highway, there's 70. Here's the arch. Oh, there's a St. Louis arch we was talking about. There it is again. This is in... Uh, Indiana, golly, we rented a great big house cabin, both Snyder families and us, Webster Lake, mm -hmm. out in the water, oops, so, whoa, yeah, Linda lost her glasses, wasn't it, and went swimming in the water, we never did find them, of course. <laughs> Bob Snyder, that in there. Or two-piece bathing suits. Does that mean? Yeah, that's right there. My there is. Suit. Wow, See, what a woman. <laughs> What's Uncle T looking at? Oh, I don't yeah. know. <laughs> Hard to tell what he's looking at. There it is, where we stayed. Playing tennis. Built uh, castles in the sand, Donnie and Missy. There we are, building the castles in the sand. You're here, Mom. <laughs> Keith, Nancy, and Donnie. Uh, this is the ferry boat we went, took a ride on on Webster Lake in Indiana. 
This is the uh, uh, United Brethren Church in Lapel, Indiana. This W.R. Snyder's with Donnie. With Donnie, yeah. Kathy. Well, there's the Harbert family in front of the Bob Snyder home in Lapel. Their home south of Lapel with Bob Snyder's. Back at the Teet and Helen home, and there's four kids. There's their big lot, and the hot, they used to have an old house on this corner. Oh, it's Susan and her boyfriend. <clears throat> Get his name. Yeah. Oh, all the kids. It looks like Grandpa, Grandpa and Grandma Snyder, Bob and Teet's dad and mother, with all our family. The Fleming girls. Here we are in going down to Dyersburg, uh, Tennessee. Jack had a job down there that we had to uh, we had to uh, look over a structural. Job. That's the structure he had to look over. <laughs> this is uh, over in Noblesville, Indiana, I think. An old uh, cabin over. Yeah, here's the Hecathorn Manufacturing Company. This is where he did his work and he stayed there in a motel. The girls went swimming in this pool. I wish those were better. That looked like some pretty good looking yeah. girls around that pool. Yeah, I keep those going. <laughs> yeah, there's a light. Oh, there's a magnolia blossom down there. Beautiful magnolias in Tennessee. There's a couple of magnolia blossoms there. <laughs> Kathy had her birthday while I was there, and I bought her a new swimming cap. And had all kinds of. Yeah, they had plenty of swimming caps. We want to be short of a swimming cap. <laughs> oh, here's little Rodney and his dog, Stormy. And Aunt Men's, Uncle Fritz and Lois. And now I'm not sure. Boy, there's an all-American couple for you. <laughs> yeah. That's a great picture. It is. There's another all-American. Three deco girls. Well, you can sure tell her sisters. Yeah. There's the Harvard sisters. Going down the road. <laughs> that looks like Boulder now. Colorado there. Springs, I think. No, I think it's Boulder. You think so? Uh -huh. Yeah, we went up there in the picnic with Grandma's Mr. Delaney. Mama's trying to set them up. <laughs> oh, this is down where? Is this your Coffee Creek Canyon? No. Oh, that old wheel they pushed. Debbie Limer's with you. Yeah. Marching in the Harvest Parade, the Harvest Festival Parade again. You see Mary? I think I see you. <laughs> That's a mother for you. <laughs> Arvada Senior High. Salt Lake City, that way. To turn off to go over Bertha Pass. That was uh, Smith's, I think, waiting for us there. Must have been the fall with beautiful aspens. It's on the road up towards Bertha Pass. Kathy yeah, looking far out. <laughs> oh, here we are in this family room with a campfire group. Every Tuesday afternoon. There they are with a campfire gown. Are these guys having fun or what? <laughs> Mary, you were oh, dressed for what no. there? Something special. Was it a, a rainbow girls thing or something? Yeah. Like that. Family in their living room, getting a little older. Halloween. The usual August. snow. <laughs> yeah. Mm, where was that campfire group? This is a. This is a halftime. Halftime show. Football game. Yeah. 
Red and white. Out no, there high. somewhere. Yeah. What was that group called you were in? That group? Yeah. Holy oh, smokes, the big a four. four foursome. What'd you call yourselves? I don't know. The one Debbie Limer, Linda Harino, Kathy Santa Pietro, and me. Yeah. No, that's one we ought to save. We ought to get a copy of that me. Yeah, we should. Well, let's we pull it out later. Ooh. Oh, they cut down that elm tree, trimmed it down. Aspen and Oh, this is the, no, this is the Sanders family up at Steamboat uh, Springs. Uh -huh. That's, was that out from the place? Steamboat Springs. Looking down, like this is where they ski in the wintertime. He's trying to play the organ. Lopsided Christmas tree. Grandma Harvard and Mary. Mm -hmm. She had her pretty pajamas and she had a... Not sure I ever seen that one. <laughs> <laughs> now, now, I wonder who made it. No, I don't I think, think it was I bought. that was bought. For, for, for once in my life. Bonnet. Yeah, I don't know. Miss Grandma Harvey. Yeah, here we are, and there's Mom Harvey. Oh, Kathy got a banjo. Christmas, 1966, this is. The Ted Smith family, Ted, Mary Ann, well, Grandma Harvey. That picture is out of focus all the way. Yeah, it is. There. Oh, that is better. Carol standing here at the end. What a bunch. We had a great time. What mm -hmm. year is this? Looks like Loveland Valley. It might be. Well, that's a nice one. There, the three girls on skis, aren't they? Well, it seems like we've seen them before. Yeah. Well, there's Mary and Debbie. My, you're dressed up pretty. And they're skiing. Oh, well, that does look like a, that Loveland Basin skier. Is this Pactolis? There's a ham operator, guys. You talking about that? Yeah. There's his radio. Yeah. He and his girls. He loved his girls. That must have been. It's good. Their heads. <laughs> Linda's birthday, February 19th. This Linda, 1967, as a junior nurse's aide. Up in the mountains. Who's that? That is Kathy, I believe, isn't it? No. Who is it? I don't know who that is. Next to her. Well, Linda in her striped pajamas. Happy birthday. Linda. Linda. Or Lydia? Linda. Linda. Yeah, that's Linda's birthday. Oh, there's Kathy and her friend. They went we went out the stable so they could ride horses. Happy birthday, Kathy. <laughs> Oh, Mary's hair is getting longer. Is that a potato? I think Donnie so. Donnie Yeah, Maria? Yeah, 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 I see her mother all the time. Ooh! Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah. Golly. Three of those people, those three on the right, all lived in Ellis Hall together. Is that right? Bill knew them. He's getting into the picture already. Yeah. Ooh. Now, what was that, Mary? That was probably your banquet dresser. Or did you have a banquet? I don't know what it was. Air Force. Air Force Academy. We took Grandma Swimming. I can do it. Oh, boy. What? What is that? <laughs> what is that? Looks like the Burtons and us and the 
Exchange student. Yeah, I think front. so. Yeah. Square dancing in our family room on New Year's Eve. Oh, uh, Edie McMurtry's kissing Jack. How dare she? Happy New Year. Look at all our Christmas cards. She looks more than kissing her. Oh, you guys Who's playing this game? Are you guys passing? Breakthrough or something. You guys had pretty wild. Wild, Wild parties. Yeah, they're that. passing the grapefruit and darling wheeler and grapefruit. You're there. probably passing them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> you need a mark for a woman. Oh boy. Look at that hair hat. <laughs> Linda's birthday again. Up at Breckenridge. We yeah. went mm -hmm. skiing. Yeah. About the only lodge up there at the time, it seemed like. Sure, sure. Breckenridge. <laughs> sure. Hey. Mom, I can't believe you let her do that. <laughs> dumb and cold. Even my green ski pants I have on, I just got rid of them. Jack ski it. That old ski coat. Campfire, kids. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your hair, Mary? I guess. <laughs> oh, so scary. Little kitties. Always have Strangling cats again. Hair, Mary. Oh, mom and dad dressed up. Good looking couple. Thank you. Good looking couple. Yes. Happy birthday, Carol. Where is she? Go ahead with the bunch. They just spiked the punch. <laughs> Carol's birthday, April 19th. Linda with the dress that she made. Did you, did you just plant that tree in honor of her birthday? <laughs> I just imagine. Mary's graduation dress was white lace. There she is, the graduating gal, 1968. The three 
sisters, and there you are with the courier. There's the four friends again. We had a big party, homemade ice cream. All of them graduating from high school. Who's that kid? We're well, your graduation. Oh, that's me, yeah. With Bill Holt. Walk down there. Is that right? Uh huh. Is that Debbie? I think Give that her a is Debbie up there. Did she give a speech? Yeah. She was the salutatorian. I think that's supposed to be there you. you are. Is it? Dale Taft. Oh, and so we took a trip to California. And we stopped, we'd be stopping and eat our meal out sometime. And what, that's that. Dad like got mad. He's hitching a ride. <laughs> All these uh, Indian uh, yeah. dwellings. That's across the Indian reservation. Uh -huh. That is. That's interesting. That who's, guy that we who's met. that guy? Well, don't you know? I don't know. He ate love. Well, he was so friendly. He wanted your number and all that. Mary was. Wanted to write to you. He was trying to hustle yeah. Mary. Who I think you him? would let us take her picture. That squall there. The one you took unless, a unless we paid or something. Grand Canyon. What is this San Diego Zoo. <laughs> Back to the Grand Canyon. Yeah, the Grand Canyon. Mary and Carol. And a Whoa. great big cactus out in the desert. Those are saguaro cactuses. Ow. Go on. Okay, we're on the beach already in California, aren't we? Early bikinis. You went, uh, oh, this looks like uh, Palm City. Is that or Sun City? I don't know. Arizona. This must be San Diego Zoo. Oh, there's Carol. <laughs> there's Linda. I remember that monkey threw his. There we are again. Yeah, then we ate at that fish grub right on the ocean. Looks like some sort of a protest. <laughs> well, a big ship out there. Park, parking lot. San Diego Zoo. Oh, this is across to uh, San Diego to... Uh, across from the hotel that you Come on, Bill. What's over there? That uh, Coronado. Coronado Hotel? Yes, the Coronado Hotel, where I used to go when I was in the Navy there. Here we are at uh, SeaWorld. SeaWorld. Mm -hmm. Uh-huh. Well, you guys have been there, haven't you? Well... Shamu. Before he died. You just pick out There they are well. performing. See the porpoises or dolphins? Water slime. Oh, these are, this is Hope and Dick Davis that lived uh, near Disneyland. Our friends from Mormon, Oklahoma. Look at there, we're at Disneyland. Look at that line. Dopey. Which one is Dopey? Oh. <laughs> There's Sleepy. There's Dopey in front, Mary, and all the girls with Dopey. What's Where's that you? called? Now, the Matterhorn? No. Yeah, the Matterhorn. Is that the Matterhorn? There's a spaceship. The spaceships you guys ride in. Mm -hmm. Those look like a kitty ride when you get up there. Oh, yeah, it's what? a small world. Oh, there's a big goofy guy with those girls. <laughs> Jumbo! Oh. We took that ride around. Mark Twain. What's it? Mouse. 
Frankenstein. Frankenstein. Frankenstein and gold. <laughs> This is, uh, they're jumping off up there like they do in the movies. They Stunt shows. The back are, lot of them. These are a lot of the... Is this Universal Studios? Universal Studios. You went through. Well, there's Walt Holmes that lived in L.A. And we picked all this good fruit off his trees. That's up at Capistrano, where the swallows come back. Every, same time, every year. I hitchhiked up there one time. The That's large. the redwoods, the great big redwoods. You see. So we got you can drive right through drive that tree. Drive right guys. through that uh, tree. Can you imagine? I see, there it is closer. That's why. Yosemite National Park. Big waterfall. This is the Yosemite National Park. Where we camp. Is that a deer? Oh yes, there was a little deer alongside the road. Everybody was stopping trying to help him. Are you doing so? Okay, there, you can see it. You can see him standing in front of that tree, just how big that tree was. That was called General Sherman. They all got names to them. They're so big. There's a little deer up there. Play in the motel swimming pool along the way. This is Schwarzel's in Fresno, California. Marcella lives in our now. Trying to balance pretty hard. Looks like you're back in the Rocky Mountains. Mm -hmm. It does. Probably are. There now, Carol is a nurse's aide. She doesn't look much different. And there we are camping again with a square dance group. I think this is not the Central City. All the back ends. <laughs> oh, we go on hikes. <laughs> There's Mary and Debbie again at Craig Rehabilitation. Is that Debbie? Is that me? That's not me. It's oh, maybe that's Carol. Yeah. Well, look at this today. Playing that. Kathy's birthday, August Looks 11. like a Verino girl there. Uh -huh. Yes, it is. She was her age. Michelle. Oh, my gosh. Linda's hanging. <laughs> Kathy oh. got skis for her birthday. And... Oh, this is the time that this is the time we took the compass and went across the mountain with the car. <laughs> Trying to find another point. Boy, that it was an old mine there. Mom and Dad. Happy trails. I wonder who took that. I don't know. Well, it looked like we're kind of tired there. Really. Mary? Who I'm working as a nurse's aide at Beth Israel Hospital. Look at that hair. It's 68, huh? And, uh, Carol and... Oh, I don't know whose car that is. That's our car, isn't it? Aspen again. Well, there's a good picture. Dad. There's a good close-up. Mm -hmm. We're on a picnic with Grandma Fleming up in the mountains. Oh, well, that's a good one. It's like Grandma was coming out of the trees. Uh, I think that was it. Putting up, pulling up her pants and being able to walk at the same time. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, 
Well, now that's Linda sound. Yeah. Well, that's too bad that one's not in there, right? <laughs> the gravel's loving part. Oh, that's... Oh, the chipmunk. Ooh, pretty mountains of that. There's the family, the zinnias and gravel fleming. Oh, our honey locust is getting bigger. Is that somebody's birthday or just a picture? Pumpkin pie. Wow. Where is this? Oh, Dad had his, what happened to his eye? Like Mary was off at college. Yeah. Wait a minute, what's that? Oh, cat. Carol and Carol Yeah. There's the Arvada Junior High field. That was a youth group from the church, Mary. You had like there was a band? band? They had a band? Halloween. Oh, that's when we made those uh, angels. I still got it. See that angel there that we made those? In was camp, that right? No. But we had more fun. Mary came home from college that year, Christmas. And we strung popcorn and stuff like that. It was a great and that tree, that tree was from our backyard. One of the huh. first ones we cut down. Don't you prove it? It's so pretty. We was gonna cut yeah. down every yeah. other tree. I remember that dress. How old is Kathy? She was about eight. ten. Yeah. She's eight years younger. Mom with the mom at that time was becoming very sophisticated. She was a college woman. Yeah, there she is. First year of college. Yeah, real sophisticated. See, she does look older. Mitzi the cat. Isn't that a sweet picture? Oh. Isn't that a sweet picture? Oh, they're jamming. Oh, I made all those frogs and that cat. The cat was Linda's and the frogs. She still were. got that green. Yeah, I do. Linda, where are you sitting on the bench? She painted that picture in back of her. She's using your radio, Mom. Dark one. Yes. Yeah. I borrowed my stuff. Oh, sunset. Here's Ellis Hall. Yeah. There it is. Here's Tanya again. Is that Tanya? Yeah. Was she in there? Yeah. Ooh, look at the snow. Breckenridge. Yes. Well, let's see. That's when it was a small ski area. <laughs> Dad came down that time and straddled a tree up there when he skied the dark corn. Look at those curlers. Oh. Still got that dark corn. There's Kathy and Jack. Here's our parents. Was this Bill Calm in this play at the high school? We saw her in Camelot. I think this is Camelot. I think before. To move her. Moving to oh, Illinois. It's time to move to Illinois. See the big van out there? There's our camper. Oh, Uncle Bob's went and stopped there, and we had both cars, and stopped there and stayed all night on our way to Illinois. Little Rod, he's getting bigger. There's our home, first home in Downers Grove, Col Illinois. College Road? Yes, mm -hmm. 2515 College Road. Kathy's at the playhouse. That was our little breakfast nook. Happy anniversary. Kids fix that up. In our dining room. What's, who are those girls, Mary? I, I don't know. This isn't mine. Well, it's, it's Linda, Linda and Jackie, Susan, oh, Carol. Sure. Somebody, Kathy. Joy. Joy and Helen Uncle Pete. Hey, Betsy and her last litter kittens, I bet. 
Nancy? Nancy isn't it? Hot belly. Oh, <laughs> this is out at the Ar at the Borden Arboretum, I believe. Well, Jack Arboretum. Do you want to try to teach off? Isn't that beautiful? The trees are beautiful out there. It's the Tiger family. Oh, this is up at oh, another park. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Here we are, six, uh, 22 years later, from 69 to 91, and now I have eight wonderful grandchildren, and I have three son-in-laws. And this is, is Billy, 12, Ian, 9, BJ, 9, and Peter, 13. And the uh, other four aren't with us. But I hope you enjoy this history from 50 to 40.